having a great start to your weekend and welcome to my video of Bear's Kitchen this Saturday. Um, today I'm gonna make a recipe that Kala actually suggested for me and I think that they're the best brownies that I've ever made in my life. Uh, so I hope that you enjoy the recipe and that you try it out sometime soon. Okay, so these are all the ingredients that you're gonna need. First off, you're gonna need 115 grams of uh, unsalted butter, two bars of semi-sweet uh, chocolate, uh, chopped like that, the way that I did it, 150 grams of granulated sugar, 50 grams of brown sugar, three eggs, one teaspoon of pure vanilla extract, 80 grams of all-purpose flour, two tablespoons of the cocoa powder I have there, and then finally, one quarter teaspoon of salt and 180 grams of semi-sweet chocolate chips. And you're gonna need these two things to measure and weigh all of these ingredients. All right, so the first step is melting the butter and the chopped chocolate in a saucepan on medium heat, as you can see here. Uh, you wanna make sure that it's not too hot because this will like mess up the chocolate and the butter. And you wanna make sure that you're stirring constantly, uh, preferably with a wooden spoon. You will then take the chocolate out of the heat and set it aside for about 10 minutes until it cools down. While this happens, you want to preheat your oven to 177 degrees Celsius and prepare a 9x9 inch square baking pan. Once your chocolate mixture is cool, you're going to whisk the granulated and brown sugars into the cool chocolate and butter mixture. Then, you're going to add the eggs one at a time, whisking until smooth after each addition. You want to make sure that you don't put them all at once. You will then whisk in the vanilla extract and keep mixing until it is smooth. And then you will gently whisk in the flour, cocoa powder, and salt. And you want to make sure that you keep mixing until you have a homogeneous mixture. Once everything is perfectly combined, you're going to fold in the chocolate chips. Now that your oven has been preheated to about 177 degrees Celsius and that you have your prepared baking pan, you're going to proceed to pour the batter into the baking pan. This is a pro tip that Kala suggested, and you will only find it in the video, not in the instructions. So what you want to do is you want to try to spread some Nutella on top of the batter before you put it in the oven, which is going to give it an extra nice finishing touch. So finally, what you're going to do is put the baking pan in the oven for about 35 to 36 minutes. Uh, but you want to start checking once... 30 minutes go by and what you're going to do is you're going to put a toothpick inside the brownie batter and you're going to know that the brownies are ready once the toothpick only comes out with a few moist crumbs. After you take the brownies out of the oven, you're going to want to let them cool for a couple minutes and then you're going to be able to enjoy your hard work and reward yourself with one of the best brownies you have ever tasted.